and uh, welcome back to Kerbal Space Program once again. Hope you're doing well. Alrighty, righty, righty. So where am I? On the tech tree right now, it seems. Let's get out of this and go straight to the vehicle assembly building. And um, yeah, basically uh, this episode or the next episode of my Kerbal Space Program series will be the final one. <laughs> yes, I'm serious because this game, in my opinion, is uh, getting a little bit boring due to the consistent amount of failures I had, you know. Because uh, this game takes uh, quite a bit of, uh, yeah, you know. Alright, so I want to get, I want to try landing on the uh, well, I still want to land on another planet or the moon. However, one of you have requested, I mean not requested, suggested, that's the word, that I should land on uh, Minmus instead. Should be easier for me. And I agree, because it is low gravity. And you need the fuel to get off another planet. Alright, I'm going to build myself a rocket and jump kind of there, okay? I've just completed my rocket. What do you think? I think it looks glorious. Anyway, I choose Jebediah. 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 <laughs> Alright, so I've called this the Debrusca Landra. Because it's going to land on the uh, Minmus. Alright, so it is like this then. Interesting. I, I don't know how they're gonna... Wait, let's see. Oh! That's, uh... Well, that's very useful, then. Alright, ready to launch SAS on, because that's usually the thing where I, you know, usually forget the most. Alright, launch! Now, I must do this ever so slightly, you know, just like my previous episode title. Yeah, we should be fine. Trust us, are you not going? Oh, I didn't activate them apparently. I start doing the same. Uh, never mind, I lost momentum on that. My fault. Well, I could save a bit of thrust. Let's see my uh, velocity, trajectory. Okay, add maneuver, I want to do this, thank you, yeah, we should be fine, I think this is uh, not fine, what did I just do? No, I just want you to be, alright, maneuver. I got one shot at this. Can't mess it up. Are you gonna maneuver for me? Full throw! Oh, 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 oh. So 
So I'm using these different thrusters with these new liquid tanks because they got an extra, uh, bit, a double the size, you know. Oh no, that's, uh. Ah, ha ha. No, no, no. We're, we're all good. We've got tons of fuel. Everything's gonna be fine. Well, I hope. Okay, I might have to take control. Aim upwards. Ever so uh oh. Let's just go back on course, shall we? Oh my god. No. I don't get... Uh, uh, the, the person that's been telling me to go straight up and then use the 70k thingy bobby majiggy what ifs and then turn the rocket it doesn't work for me not anymore this is why I gotta turn the rocket early uh, I, I might I might have this I don't know oh that was a bad idea no I'm gonna have to restart this is why I gotta turn early so I can prevent this. <laughs> I don't take responsibility on that one. This guy that's been telling me to turn... I don't know if it was Super Gupper or not. But, uh... Basically, I was always being told... Yeah, so basically, um, someone told me just to point upwards instead of turning. Otherwise, I just go out of control. The thing is, if it goes straight up, you're just going to be pulled back by the gravity. It doesn't matter how, how far you go, unless you get further away from the gravitational object that you're on and go to the next one that the gravitational object is basically orbiting, like the sun. But well, I don't want that. <laughs> uh, this is why I go to turn early. Man, these thrusters are not doing that much. Uh, that's a pro. Oh no, I forgot to add it. Ah. So I made sure that it is uh, detachable on the control part of the ship. Because if it wasn't, I wouldn't be able to land back safely. And the game was a little bit buggy with the old uh, construct connecty thingies down here. They're not exactly connected, so if if, if something happens to the rocket, then I, I can't explain. It's just uh, physics, or it's a bug or something, I don't know. Anyways, launch! Oh, I didn't retract these. All right, now we're good. Oh, what the f- No, 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 why? No, 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 no. No, what just happened? Keep it stable, please? Hmm. 
Why weren't these grouped together? Can you keep it together, please? Is that even possible at this point? Is it not possible now? Because of that. I don't even know why this wasn't grouped together. Okay, it's, it's stabilizing, it's stabilizing, this is good. Ah, oh, we're good now. I might still have this in the bag, or we'll see. No, I just, no, no, I just want to click on it. No, I just want to click on the thing and just it. What are you doing, game? For frick's sake, I don't want to do that. Oh my word, this th okay, now it's working. I've been mean, left clicking it, it keeps coming up with the options. This game does everything I want it to, but oppositely. Okay, can you, ugh. It's so stressful, I swear, all the times, uh, something like this happens, when I fail a mission, it's usually not my fault, because this game is like, Oh, you want you wanted this? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, maneuver. I don't know why that's unlocked. Maybe because of the waypoint or something. <sighs> now I'm using the other thrusters to realign to the swivel because the other ones were powerful enough, and since they're not long uh, length enough for these retractors, I don't know if I'll be able to get off. Uh, what's it called? Um, What's, what's a uh, minimus? That's right. I don't even know what the gravity is, so. Well, I know the gravity is low. It's not much. I'm hoping it's not too much gravity. Okay, so this one's a different thruster. I am still picking up a lot of speed. Am I not going to reach the... Oh no. Not again. Now see, if the group, if the rocket, if the thrusters were grouped together, this would not have happened. Alright. Come on, you can do it. Just make it. There, okay, there's the ring, there's the ring, about 2,000 meters a second. That's awesome. I'm losing altitude, but that's fine now because we're making a lot of progress. I haven't seen my apoapsis or pre apoapsis. Preapolapsis. Frio. Frio. Uh, I don't even know what it's called. Prolapsis. There we go. Alright, there we go. There it is. Uh, are we good? I can't see the thing because it's in the way. Alright, we're good. We're good now. Alright, there. That, that was stressful. How much fuel did I lose? Too much. Great. Won't be again enough to land on the moon now. Ah, oh, that's fun. <laughs> Alright, Minmus is all the way over there. Huh. That's just perfect. Right, let's get rid of that. And speed up time! Because we have all the time in the universe.
All right, so Mo Minmus is moving very slow. Okay. So I need a... Let's wait for the mun, the moon, to get out of the way. All right, should be good. By the time I go over there, the moon's going to be out of the way. That's why I did that. Okay, a maneuver. And I'm going to spin my way all the way to... Uh, Okay, what's this here? Alright, that's what I want. I might have to restart because I, the old rocket went as a Rooney. Oh god, what just happened? Okay, it's the moon. That's all good. I want to encounter the damn... Ah. Oh. I'm really trying to do this. I don't want the Minmus escape. What? I, I want to... Okay, so I've encountered it. Alright, so I'm going this way. Yes, that's what I wanted. Yes, at last. Okay. Right, now, I just want to... Yes. Yeah, you, you're picking up what I'm putting, putting down there? You finally understand. We did it. Oh, I did it. <laughs> I did it. I orbited Minmus successfully. Wow. So this will be the time where I try to land on the on the Minmus. All right, there we go. So what I'll do is I'll uh, do some science right here. Hey, look at that. More science. And more science. Awesome. Makes me wonder if I'm going to have enough fuel to get on. We shall see. Hey, all I need to do is just get out of the minimus gravity and then I'm just good. Here we go. Yeah, there's really not that much gravity. Wow. Okay, I don't want to nail on that part. Oh god. No, no, no. let's uh, keep thrusting. 
Let's get rid of... Oh, no, no. What are you doing, game? Don't do that to me. Don't you dare... Change my view. I oh, God. That's so wonky. Can you please not do that? Okay, good. Alright, now I need a sword again. <laughs> I bet you guys are like waiting to see how I'm gonna do this. Well, I know physics, okay. No, 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 it needs to be like this so I can... Yeah, that's about it. Slowing down. We need to make a limit. Make it 50%. Now let's put it down to like 20. Okay, how fast is too fast? I don't know. Maybe 20 is a little bit too low. Let's go 30. Okay, I don't want to lose all my speed. Okay, I just need to let gravity do its thing. That's all I need to do now. Look how happy Milford is. I hope I can land on a flat ground, you know. Alright, let's extend these. Awesome. Let's get a screenshot. Alright, I need to turn this. Maybe this is fine. Okay, game, I need you to cooperate. There's no time for caution. Okay, I might need to... Alright. <laughs> it's a... Uh, uh, he's going to kind of gamble at this point. Thrust. Thrust to be. We got this. Oh, uh, oh, uh, more thrust, more thrust. No, I can't have it. Oh no. Okay, all right. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm so afraid I'm going to tip over the rocket when I land. That's the problem. I need to be, like, idle. It's just... Ever so... Ever so slightly. This is hardcore. Ever so... Slightly... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I'm so close. Yes. Come on. You can do it. Oh, no. No. I f oh, no. I screwed it up. No. Oh, 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 oh. Ow, ow, ow. Please be sitting up, Rocket. Please. No, you can do it. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, 
don't know. Yes, yes. I made it to all the way to Minmus. Oh, you should. I couldn't do it, huh? <laughs> I did it first try. First try, look at me. Jetpack. Oh. I'm on the moon. I mean the the Minmus, not the moon. Hey! <laughs> All right, time to get a thumbnail. Oh, that's so awesome! Oh, site name. Minmus. Alright. <laughs> EVA report. 40 science. Keep experiment. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> Wow, this is such an accomplishment. I honestly didn't think I'd be able to do this. Like, if I was landing on the moon, uh, I probably wouldn't be able to make it. <laughs> I might just uh, damage my rocket or something. Yeah, but Minmus is pretty easy, I gotta say. Alright, well, we're on Minmus now, but it's time to get back. Let's see if I can do it. All right, jetpack. Let's go. All aboard. Uh oh, wait, no. Board. There we go. I right, was well, time to leave Minmus and go back to Kerbal. All right, let's uh, let's go. There I go, and retracting. Yeah, I should be able to make it back. I did it! Awesome! Goodbye, Minmus! And now I'm orbiting Kerbal! Awesome! So where am I going? This way. Gotcha. Set a maneuver here. Reduce this. Now I need to go down to like 40,000. Oh, about 50,000 just to be absolutely sure. I don't want to encounter the man. No. Well, let's just do this for now. 56 days? What?
Oh, I suppose that makes sense. Uh, hello? Do I have to use thrust to be able to turn this? Alright. That can't be right. Am I going to have to get out and use the jetpack just to push this or something? Don't I have like dampening thrust or something like that? I, I seriously cannot control. Are you telling me that I can't do this because I don't have enough electric charge? Because at least with this thruster I can actually swivel it. Why well, stupid though, am I supposed to carry extra power? I was, I was never told that. No one ever told me that. That I needed like a battery or anything like that. Is this moon really going to be a problem now? Wait, no it isn't. Oh, fantastic. It's not going to be. Yeah, does it matter how fast I'm going? That's also another thing I should probably wonder. Oh, I got no control over this, don't I? What happens if I disconnect it? Good or bad? You know what? Save. I can't control it, are you serious? No. No, if I lose this because I got no power in the ship. Again, if that was so important, why didn't no one tell me? No one told me about this. I have no control. It's it's gonna destroy itself now because I can't control this. So the last question remains. Will I be able to eject the parachute? I mean, activate the parachute. <laughs> If I got no electricity or any power, the, I, I, I doubt it would work, but this, if it doesn't work, I'm screwed. Just saying. I mean, I didn't think I need a battery. Or antenna. Alright, and the burn is complete. We made it through the atmosphere and we slowed down enough. Now... If the ship can automatically point this way, I should be able to do the same when I'm landing. I really hope that's the case. Yeah, it's doing that. Awesome. I'm so glad that can happen. Alright, just to play it safe, I'm gonna activate it. Please work, please work. Yes! It's working! I can't believe I did it! <laughs> I made it to Minmus and back to Kerbal. No! Oh, we're, we're still fine. We're still fine. <laughs> There's a cactus over there. That's interesting. Well, at least I got to land on the uh, daytime side of Kerbal. So, yeah. <laughs> Awesome! Let's go to the tracking station to recover 
the uh, the ship. Oh yes, 135 signs earned. How about that? And Milford survived. Oh yes, I actually did it. I went all the way to Minimus and all the way back to Kerbal in one piece and survived without power. How about that? Anyway, this will be the final episode of Kerbal Space Program. Hope you all enjoyed this uh, this series. It was fun. You guys requested me uh, based on the vote polls uh, to try Kerbal Space Program. I'm glad you uh, voted for it because uh, I had fun. It was difficult learning, but I eventually got there on my own, you know. But I really thought I wasn't going to make it back. <laughs> Alright, save, save. And let's go back to main menu. Yeah, um, yeah, for Kerbal Space Program, it, it is fun. I'll give it C grade in terms of enjoyment. Um, it's not getting the the views I expected. I expected like at least double the views it was getting. Uh, but you know, uh, it is. It did get slightly a little bit boring trying to do this over and over again, start from the beginning. I can see why people find it boring, you know. Uh, I understand it too, so I think I'm complete with Global Space Program. Uh, it was definitely worth the money. Uh, well, it was on sale, by the way. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely fun. So, uh, if you like rockets and the science, yeah, try to say it. I mean, there's Global Space Program too. I'm not interested in that one. I he I've heard way too many, oh, I don't know, negative feedback on that. I'm not interested in that, and I'm not interested in continuing to play this game. Because if I do, it's just going to get even more complicated, so I, I'd rather not go that way. Um, so yeah. Anyways, like I said, thanks for watching, and for being here, and helping me out to be able to do this. I really do appreciate it. Uh, so yeah. Thanks everyone for watching this video on Couple Space Program. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, and subscribe to follow my channel. I don't just do Kerbal Space Program, I also do other games too. I record other things too. You can check them out on my channel. And I appreciate it if you follow along, you know. I've been trying to... My goal is to get to 10,000 subscribers, so I appreciate it if you subscribe, you know. And I shall see you next time. In another video. So until then, have a good day.